In GTA 6, natural disasters will be a major milestone in the series, offering a new and more immersive gaming experience. The city will suffer from extreme weather events, such as hurricanes, earthquakes, and heavy rains, which will leave a notable impact on the virtual environment. Hurricanes, for example, will bring a sense of chaos and urgency as they approach the city. Players will need to prepare or adapt quickly, seeking shelter or finding ways to protect themselves against the violent winds and torrential rain. Streets will be flooded, cars will be swept away, and buildings may be damaged or partially destroyed, creating a chaotic and challenging environment. Earthquakes, in turn, will add a surprising element to the game. When an earthquake hits the city, players will feel the tremors, and buildings and structures will begin to shake. This will not only increase the tension, but also offer unique opportunities for spectacular missions and escapes as the characters must deal with the city crumbling around them. Heavy rain, on the other hand, will affect gameplay in more subtle but equally significant ways. The streets will become slippery, affecting the handling of vehicles and creating additional challenges for escaping from the police or completing high-speed missions. Additionally, flash floods can create unexpected obstacles, such as submerged cars and blocked roads. These natural disasters will not only make the world of GTA 6 more realistic, but they will also provide strategic and narrative opportunities for players to explore. They will have to consider weather events when planning their actions, whether to avoid imminent dangers or to take advantage of circumstances to their advantage. This introduction of natural disasters in GTA 6 will be a milestone in the franchise, enriching gameplay and players' immersion in a super dynamic and constantly changing world. The elements of hurricanes, earthquakes, and heavy rain will add a new level of challenge to the game, providing players with a unique and diverse experience. The dynamics of aging and wear of elements on the map will be a revolutionary innovation in GTA 6. Players will be able to see the passage of time within the game in a much clearer way now. Vice City will gradually wear out as the story progresses. Buildings, roads, and urban infrastructure will begin to show the signs of time as the game's hours pass. Once imposing skyscrapers will begin to have broken glass, peeling paint, and perhaps even weakened structures. The roads will be full of holes and cracks, making driving difficult and creating additional challenges for players. Furthermore, vegetation will also undergo visible changes over time. Trees will grow, flourish, and eventually wither. Green fields can turn into dry and desolate areas. These changes will not only add an impressive level of realism to the game, but will also influence gameplay. For example, denser vegetation may provide better hiding places during chases or stealth missions. Even vehicles will not escape wear and tear. Cars and motorcycles will suffer from weather exposure, accumulated dirt and collision damage over time. Players will have the option to maintain their vehicles, but if they choose not to, the vehicles will clearly show signs of use and aging. This wear and tear characteristic will add unique depth to the gaming experience. Players will feel like they are truly immersed in an ever-evolving world where their actions have a tangible impact on the environment. The character's decisions and the passage of time will leave an indelible mark on the city, creating a dynamic narrative that evolves along with the gameplay. The weathering of the environment and map elements in GTA 6 will be a stunning innovation, further elevating the series to an unprecedented level of realism and depth. Players will feel truly part of this ever-changing world, where every choice and action will leave its mark on the game's environment and narrative. Players will be able to count on a fully functional public transport system across the entire Vice City map. It will be an improved feature of GTA 5, which will make getting around in the game more practical and realistic than ever. With the implementation of this public transport system, players will have a variety of options available to move around the city. This includes buses, subways, trains, and even taxis and transport apps like Uber. Each mode of transport will have its own characteristics and advantages, making the choice of transportation a strategic part of the game. Buses will allow players to travel in groups, making them a convenient choice for team missions or transporting cronies. Subways and trains will offer speed and efficiency to cover long distances quickly, ideal for spectacular escapes or quickly reaching important mission locations. Taxis, in addition to being practical for individual journeys, can offer interesting dialogues with drivers, providing an immersive experience and perhaps even valuable information. This functional public transport system will also have an operating schedule, adding a touch of realism to the game. 
Players will have to consider opening hours when planning their activities, making time management an important part of the gameplay. Additionally, players will have the option to customize their public transport vehicles, making them unique and styled according to their personal tastes. This adds an additional layer of customization to the game. The introduction of this public transport system to GTA 6 will not only make getting around more convenient, but it will also enrich the game world, making it more alive and original. Players will be able to experience daily life in the city more fully, interacting with NPCs and observing the urban landscape as they move from one point to another. A working public transport system in GTA 6 will be an innovation that will significantly enhance gameplay, providing players with more options and opportunities to explore the vast game world in a more realistic and immersive way. Rockstar Games is committed to keeping GTA 6 continually engaging and engaging for players after launch by implementing frequent updates to the game's map. This strategy will ensure that players always have something new to explore and enjoy in an ever-evolving world. After the game's official release, Rockstar will continue to expand the Vice City map, but new cities will also be introduced consistently. This means that new neighborhoods, districts, and unique locations will be added regularly, creating an ever-growing gaming experience. Each update will bring a new layer of detail to the game world, making it even more realistic and dynamic. These expansions will not just be limited to adding new locations, but will also include seasonal events, quests, and special challenges that will keep players coming back to the game regularly. For example, seasonal party events, racing competitions, or additional story missions that seamlessly integrate into the game's main storyline. Rockstar will also explore the integration of virtual reality and augmented reality elements to make the experience even more immersive. This could include special events and missions that are only available to players who choose to utilize these advanced technologies. Additionally, the company will continue to improve the artificial intelligence of NPCs, making the city's virtual inhabitants more realistic and interactive. Players will feel like they are truly in a constantly moving world, with NPCs who have their own unique routines, stories, and interactions. The introduction of these frequent map updates in GTA 6 is a commitment from Rockstar Games to provide a gameplay experience that remains relevant and exciting over the long term. This will also ensure that the gaming community continues to grow and engage, creating a robust and dynamic multiplayer experience. It is important to note that all this information is based on leaks and speculation and has not been officially confirmed by Rockstar Games, the game's developer. While these ideas have been seen in leaks, we must remember that GTA 6 is still a project in development and specific details may change before the official release. So until Rockstar Games releases concrete information, we must maintain a certain degree of skepticism in regarding these leaks. What do you think? Leave your comments below and don't forget to subscribe for more GTA 6 news.